go there to ski and that's it. For Gary Newton, getting rid of his Tahoe timeshare has been an uphill battle. There's no resale market. He's tried selling it, even giving it back to the vacation resort. And finally decided to pay a timeshare exit company $3,600 to get rid of it. And the deal was they would initiate the process. They would give me an update every month. The agreement promised a safe and secure transfer strategy that, quote, usually takes three to nine months. But a year and a half later, Newton was still waiting. It's been 18 months with really nothing. And he's not alone in his timeshare exit troubles. According to timeshare website Red Week, at least 1.15 million timeshare owners want out. It is possible you could be stuck with it forever. The California Real Estate Commissioner warns a glut of properties and owners desperate to get rid of them has created easy prey for unscrupulous timeshare exit companies. We want consumers to stay away from companies that aren't licensed, who make bold promises, who charge money up front. The upfront fees are really a huge indicator of fraud. We asked Bell to examine the agreement Gary signed, which the commissioner says appears intentionally vague. I'm not certain what it is they're purporting to do. If you can't explain what they're going to be doing, you definitely don't want to give them money. Tired of waiting, Gary contacted us and we reached out to the company, which agreed to refund his money, leaving Gary right back where he started, stuck with a timeshare he doesn't want, and yearly maintenance fees he can't get rid of. If anybody even came in and said, I'll give you 50 cents, I would have said, it's yours. <laughs> and if you want a timeshare in Tahoe, <laughs> you sell them over 50 cents. Now, the Trade Association for Timeshare Industry uh, does advise owners who want to get rid of their timeshares to contact the resort developer or HOA directly to see if they can work out an exit deal solution on their own. They also advise timeshare owners not to pay an upfront fee to anyone offering to get rid of a timeshare. But bottom line, they say, listen, if you buy a timeshare, you need to realize You're stuck you with may it. be stuck with that forever. Oh.